The truth will set you free, but first it'll piss you off. Hey, bad bitches wanna be my fate. Hey, nice. Your work is paying off because you've gotten rid of that habit that you had of rushing back to recovery. If you can stick the split just a fraction of a second longer, it's perfect. That's it. That is it. You're sticking the landing, but every time you rush back, that's when you're, you're putting more weight in your back leg before it's prepared. And that's when you get that shuffle. You took the split off, so you can't drive and split. You're already in a compromised position. Go for it again. Get your hips extended. You're not getting tall enough. You're just rushing through to the split position. You've got to focus on sticking the landing. and Don't rush out of the split position. Don't rush, take your time. Once it's overhead, you get to take your time. You're getting on the rack, and just before you stand up, you go like this. So you're trying to jerk from that, and it's just impossible. So when you do dip, you've got no base of support under your left knee, so you're caving, you can't, you can't get it up. That's why you feel like you're being weak. But you keep your feet together as you come up. Don't move your feet again. Like, be positive about it. Like, you're looking a million bucks. Like, yeah, you're fucking sore, but... Your body doesn't grow if it's not challenged. What about all the chumps that aren't fucking sore at the moment? What are they doing? Planning their fucking vacations. You're getting ready for the fucking com games. Like, it's supposed to be fucking miserable. That's why chumps quit. Real fast dip. Yeah, that's it. Fast, fast, fast. Yes. Yeah, great job. That is literally the only thing you could have done better. That was a great job. Great job.